a freeze frame of him in the act of committing one crime. I think it's insane. I've never heard of that. It's crazy. This man's actions alarm neighbors and Miami-Dade residents we spoke with. Any, anytime someone's breaking into school and there's children involved, you know, it's something you have to be concerned about. Lieutenant Raul Correa of Miami-Dade Schools says this man has victimized three schools, including Edison Middle and Senior High and Jose Diego Middle between September 2013 and this past August. He's taken at least eight cameras and copper wiring. Well, what we could see is a very uh, brazen individual that's uh, taken upon himself to uh, remove cameras from schools, uh, cameras that we use for surveillance purposes to keep our kids safe. So what he's really doing is jeopardizing the safety of our kids at the schools. Korea says he always strikes between 3 a.m. and 8 a.m. Average build, um, thin. He's uh, roughly 35 to 45. He has a small little scar above his left eye, a mustache. He is also about five foot six to five nine and often wears a white t-shirt with a black and gold logo. It's not known why he's been targeting surveillance cameras. That means you to get this guy off the street. It'd be a, a, a safer school community, obviously. Well, other than impacting school safety, this criminal has caused more than $10,000 worth of damage. Lieutenant Correa believes he does live somewhere in the area, and finding him is a top priority. If you can help, call Miami-Dade Crime Stoppers at 305-471-TIPS. We're live in Northwest Miami-Dade. Peter Dench, CBS 4 News.